Welcome to your first lesson on putting the trombone together. When you get your trombone, the first thing I want you to do is I want you to put the case directly on the floor in front of you. Please don't try to put your trombone together on your lap. All the pieces can go flying everywhere. So be safe and put the case right on the floor like that. Once your case is flat on the floor, you're going to tilt it on the side so that the latches, that's these things right here, the things that are going to help us open the case, the latches are going to be facing you. You'll know if it's the right way up if the logo is up facing you as well. Okay, so the latches are going to be facing you and you want the logo going up. Now, the good thing about trombone is that the case is uh, made so that if you open it upside down one time, all the pieces should stay together. So hopefully that will happen if you open it the opposite way. So flip open those latches and open up your trombone case. Oh, wow, your brand new trombone. How exciting. Now, what I want you to do is I want you to take your right hand. Now, really quick, to tell the difference between your right and your left, your left when you're looking at your left hand, it's gonna face, it's gonna make an L shape when you look at it. So when you're looking at my left hand, it probably looks backwards to you. Okay, but when you're looking at your left hand, it's gonna be the one that makes an L when you're looking at it. Okay, so I'm gonna take my right hand, which to me doesn't look like an L, it might look like an L to you. I'm gonna take my right hand, and the first thing I'm gonna do is grab the slide section. When I grab the slide section, I grab both handles of my slide. I don't grab it from the, the curved part down here, because watch what happens. Oh no, that would not be good, right? So I always grab it with my right hand by both handles of the trombone. Once I have the slide and I have it secured with both handles, I put it on the floor directly in front of me with the larger end of the slide facing me. There's a shorter end and a larger end. I'm not going to face the larger end that way, or that way, or that way, but the larger end is going to be coming right towards me, okay? So once your slide is in the right position, don't forget to hold it by both handles, please. You're going to take your left hand and grab the bell section. Now when you take the bell section with your left hand, you're going to put the left, uh, sorry, you're going to put the bell section on your left knee, okay? so that the receiver part is facing the same direction towards your slide. So in other words, I'm not gonna have it facing the opposite way, I'm not gonna have it facing this way, I'm gonna have this part right here, the part that attaches to the slide, facing the trombone, okay? Once I have that, I'm gonna make sure I have my right hand holding both handles, okay? And I'm going to put the two sections together, okay? Again, still holding with two hands. Now this part can be different based on what kind of trombone you have. So my trombone, the lug nut kind of just twists up like this. So I'm going to just twist until it's really nice and tight. Yours might twist down, that's okay, as long as you just get it so it's nice and tight because you don't want it all kind of slipping around when you watch the next video that's gonna teach you how to hold it. So you tighten it till it can't, there we go, I can't move it, okay? And then once it's together, it should make an L shape. Not like an I shape, but an L shape. Okay, so L shape, all right? Then you're gonna put the trombone back down on the floor. You always want the curved part down on the floor with the, with the slide, okay? So we've got our bell section and our slide section together. The last thing we're gonna do is we're gonna grab our mouthpiece and we're gonna gently twist the mouthpiece right in. You don't wanna, Hit it like that, please. Don't hit it like that. Your mouthpiece will get stuck, and who knows when your teacher will be able to help you get that unstuck. So please be very careful about getting it stuck. If it gets stuck, happens all the time, don't worry about it. Just let our, your teacher know, and we'll be happy to help you fix it. So don't get your mouthpiece stuck, okay? And you just twist it in, all right? And then in the next video, we'll talk about how to hold your trombone. But for now, we're gonna take our mouthpiece out, twist and pull it out, Mouthpiece back in the case, unscrew the lug nut. Now here's where you got to be careful again. My right hand is going to be holding both handles while my left hand twists and pulls the bell off of the slide. Hooray. Okay. My first step, put the bell back. And with all these pieces, the slide and the bell, it's gonna fit like a puzzle. So if you kind of have it and it's not quite fitting, 
you're probably putting it in the incorrect way. So it should just go in really normally. It's going to fit like a puzzle. In my case, the parts like kind of snap in so you can even get that little satisfying feeling like, ooh, okay. The slide, again, be careful. Please don't turn the slide upside down, okay. Hold it by both handles, curved part facing the ground, and then slide the curved part in first, and then it snaps back in. I shut the case. And that is how you put your trauma together and take it apart. If you have any questions, please let your teacher know and they'll be happy to help you in your lessons. Have a great day.